back to another episode of KCA, where today we're on the Reed Lake. Well, this is our first session of spring. Not too cold, is it? Not too bad? I've still got thermals on. I've still got a jacket on. I've still got a jumper and a t-shirt on. It's cold. It's all right, ain't even that bad. But it says you, you've got a cold. It's all right, it's man flu. Yeah, right, actually, sit, uh, <laughs> stand away from me. No, this lake is, what, two acres big. There's a good head of 30s in there. There's a good head of 20s in there. And apparently there is a 40-pound grass carp in here. Yeah. Obviously, we don't know absolutely loads about this lake. We just yeah. happen to come across it. So if we do get things wrong, guys, bear, bear with us. Yeah. It ain't really our fault on this one. Our cameraman, right, I, put, I put into a group chat, Guys, I'm struggling for a lake. We're going on bank holiday. It's going to be Ramo. So our cameraman yeah. said, here. I was like, what, you want to go here or you just want to like be around this area? He All he put was here, full stop, exclamation mark, and laughing face. I was just like... How pal. <laughs> I was just like, okay, I'll just book here then. Yeah. <laughs> no worries. But yeah, so... Yeah. The well, rules are pretty strict on it. You're only allowed pellets and boilies, no maggots, no worms, no artificial baits, nothing. Literally, pellet, boil, uh, pellets uh, well, and boilies. And pop-ups, guys. And pop-ups. <laughs> you're allowed yeah. pop-ups. Um, apart from that, guys, we'll, we'll keep you in, informed of where we do catch. Yep. But we've got a few things that we want to show you today. Yep. You know, rig tie-in. I have little bits and pieces. I'm Cameraman's also... got some new bait alarms and they are pretty cool, I would like to say. I don't even know what to say to that. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, guys, just bear in mind, first, time, first ever time here, don't know much about the lake, but whatever we do know, we will keep you informed. All right? Oh, an absolute beauty. Finally, the cameraman. AKA my little brother has finally got into the thirties club. Whee! Proud of you, bro. Well done. Lovely. I think you've taken a uh, master angler title now, haven't you? Yeah. Right, let's put that back. That is some chunk. Jake, have a look at this, man. Lovely dark common. He's old boy. First 30 pounder on Kent Carp Anglers. By the cameraman himself. Yeah, that's the show, it's done. Sorry, can we just get a close up there? Can we just get a close up there? <laughs> there <you go>. <laughs> <laughs> all the fins are all right. Yeah. yeah, off we go, boy. Can we fold it so you can see it coming off? There we go. Beautiful. Jack. Well done, mate. Well done. Lovely stuff. How do you feel, Ben? I'm well proud of my little brother. So, guys, as KCA's tradition shows, our cameraman's going to get blessed. That's it, by the fishing gods. Well done. Well done. God bless. God bless. Do I do the whole lot or do I do a little bit? Yeah, that was good for you, didn't you? What would you do <laughs> if I had caught the fish? I'd be nice. No, that you've got to get back to you the know. <laughs> You would have got two of these, would he? One from no. you and one from Jake. No, it's lovely. Have a little lovely. bit, Carl. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Off we go. Well done. Well done. Well done, Jake. You want to have a go, would you? Oh, of course oh, I do, of son. Of course Come I on, do. Jake. Come on, Off you go. No, this is out of all bang out of all That's <laughs> oh, not, is it? That's not. You, up for this. you, you did. Right. So, guys, by the way, this is Jack. He is a cameraman. Was. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, he's got his notice in now. I'm just going to say now, I am so happy. He hasn't caught since last year. All right, all right. And <laughs> now he's just mulled both of us in one. Yeah, but we taught him how to put bait on the hook. Well, so that that's is why very well true. So, for that, Jack. Yeah, about five, six pound bigger than your both yours, isn't it? May the power of Christ compel you. Yep. Well, well done to the fishing pieces. gods. Yep. Oh, I'm coming back. Yeah. And that's how it's done, yeah. people. So, come with me. Come with me. Come with me.
Excuse me, I'm busy right now. No, no right, look, 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 right. Just, just come here a minute. Come here. Come, come stand there. So for all you that don't know, this is Jack. All right, this is Ben's little brother. Yeah. Big little Ben. Yeah, big yeah. little Ben. A lot bigger than little Ben. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a size 32 race. Jack's got a 37. <laughs> <laughs> Too, this, is, <laughs> this is Jack, okay? Jack has been a massive, massive help to us over the last God knows how long. I am the reason why Kent Carp Anglers is a thing. There you go, <laughs> bigging himself up yet yeah, again. Yeah, there we go. He helps out with the Instagram, well, he done most of the Instagram work. He's been an absolute f fantastic resource that me and him have had. TikTok. Priceless. Instagram. For, TikTok. Think. Priceless. Facebook. Yeah. Okay, uh, can, I, can, I, can, I, can I just pause? Priceless. Well, I am now the master angler now. Okay, okay. But who got you to this spot? Me. Who got you the to... car and diesel. No, 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 no. <laughs> who who taught you to put the bait on the hair? Uh, I can't remember. This was time ago. I don't remember what I done yesterday. I'll tell you what. I'll throw you in the lake. I've already had half. I'll throw you in the lake. I've had half. Be of very lake. careful of your next words. <laughs> You're not too late to leave. But no, he has been absolutely priceless. Obviously... We couldn't do it done all the all the Instagram stuff and everything by ourselves. So thank you very much for that, bruv. Oh, you know? Send the invoice See? later. He's walking on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um but that being said, Jack, what do you think about this lake? Well, this morning was a bit was a bit iffy. Mm. And the mood was very down. Mm. So as you can see the I've nearly killed myself in our swim. Because as you see by that wooden pillar there is a little bit of water and obviously you can't see what's underneath <laughs> that and i went straight through that <laughs> um the guy that came here this morning he was the happiest man i've ever seen on this planet um but yeah um well they, they did say it does say on the website get seven till seven seven till seven we got here for seven don't um, open till eight no again Guys, obviously this might have been a one-off because it's Bank Holiday Weekend. It could have been anything. We're not quite sure. But on the website, it definitely says 7 till 7. So, look, we was early, lads. Mm. For the first time in our lives, we've actually been early for something. But in overall, this is is a nice complex. The lake is nice. I mean, the fish that I had well, was absolutely in mint condition as well. And, uh, I mean, the other lake is 15 acre. You can't even get over there. Yeah, so many you bods can't actually though. get over there. I know it's bank holiday weekend. We were prepared for that. And, but yeah, same with this lake, fairly booked. There's literally, I think, I don't even think there's a swim left on this lake. No, we no. took the last ones. But then again, that says it says it all, doesn't it? How exactly. How this lake is and returning people. Exactly. So with that being said, guys, you've got to remember a couple of things when you do come here. You've got to look up. Okay. Right. So it is twenty pounds per day ticket. Okay, is that free rods as well? Is it? That's it, so everyone's allowed free rods. If you decide to fish in a swim with someone, so like Jack and Ben are, yep. it's two rods only. Yep, which is totally understandable because you are very limited for space. Okay, yep. you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, not about nine swims on this lake. Which, personally, personal preference, a little bit too much. Okay, especially on a day like this, you know. Two acre lake. You yeah. know, you've got every, you got every, every Tom Dick and Harry with three rods. And it's just, it's just all a little bit of a mess. You are allowed to use bait boats here. Oh, is that still a subject, Ben? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Ben's bait boat has decided to go night-night. Yeah. <laughs> um, toilet facilities. I mean, the only thing here is we're at the very beginning of the entrance and the toilets are i would drive it <laughs> <laughs> but i'm not being funny right like guys let me just say something when ben says he'll drive it it's a two minute walk. It's, it's more than a two minute walk yes to, to the toilets is more than a two minute walk yeah but obviously that being said it has got toilet facilities a lot of places that we have been haven't had them okay it is now basically springtime I want to see fish coming. Okay. So that being said, hopefully fish start waking up. But you got to be careful, people. Spawning season is upon us. Now, we don't 
typically like to fish when it's spawning but sometimes we do okay so with that aspect of videos we're gonna have to let you know in advance of what's happening because i don't think we even know ourselves at this point um so we're gonna try and figure something out try and figure out a new new concept for videos um me and ben had a discussion the other day in the van 24 hour rod race gets carp blah 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 how would you like, how would you guys like to see challenges on our channel? You know, obviously we're all about accepting for the audience and catering for you guys. So tell us, do you want to see challenges on this video or do you just want to see more late reviews or what Like, what, what do you guys want to see? That being said, I met a very nice guy and our last fishing session. Where's you, Ben? I was there. No, you weren't. Our last fishing session, I was there. Yeah, where, but where did you go? Home. When? Halfway through. Right, well then, thank you very much. So when, when after Ben left, that it was actually time to go home. Yeah, real. I'd like to say, it was raining. I didn't have a bivvy. Jake did have a bivvy. Yes, I did. It was in my bivvy. That's what I said. You had a bivvy. And you were sitting in it? Yeah, I was. I got cold. I got wet. And I wimped out. And I went home in a nice and dry. Why, right, Jake can carry on. Did you catch anything? Yeah. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. Cold. Exactly. No, I still said. So, so, so did the cameraman. Thank you very much. All, all for you two. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so guys, if you want to see more uh, challenges and anything like that, let us know. Let us know what sort of challenges you want as well. You've given us some great suggestions of some lakes. Absolutely pucker. Please keep them coming, because my little brain's running out of ideas. Okay, so guys, just leave it in comments. There again. That's the size of his, you know what. Anyway, <laughs> so guys, let us know what you want. Okay, mate, it'll be extremely beneficial to us. It takes a little bit of the thinking work out of the videos. Um, also, guys, let us know what baits you like using. Ben's. I've had a nightmare release today. It's side using paintballs against me. <laughs> Ben's is this, okay? It's a freezer, it's the freezer range from mainline cell boilies. And usually it tips them off with maggots, but guess what? You're not allowed maggots here. No. And um, the pellets as well. I use the pellets as well. Okay. Jax is, is Parker Bates. He absolutely <sighs> loves Parker Bates. We've actually met some of the guys from Parker Bates. And a video should be happening with them at some point. Yeah. Don't really know yet. He also caught his PB on Park Park Race as well. Um, me, I'm mix and match. I love a little bit of everything. Whatever seems decent enough on the day, I'll use. But I can see little Ben's little noodle arms getting tired now. So I'm going to go. I'll catch up with you a little bit later on. So, guys, you've been watching another episode of King Carp Anglers where Jack has absolutely smashed his PB. Smash me, Ben, while he's at it. <laughs> it's your back on. <laughs> um, but look, it is what it is at the end yeah. of the day. You can't catch every time and keep telling you guys this. Guys, again, it's been an amazing journey um, from start to finish. Um, finish? Well, from start, to, from start till now. Yeah. Um, it's been a one hell of a journey and we just keep growing and we can't say thank you enough for it really it's just been absolutely a magical journey and we hope we can keep giving you any entertainment or knowledge that you guys need to carry on but yeah anything you want to say little benji bubs no no <laughs> what do you mean no roll, roll on next trip i'll be there next trip well i'll say goodbye then yeah, see you later bye. people have a great easter and big up